Hi everyone, Miss Ella here. So I've had a couple of viewers asking me about what to do with these little baby cloves that grow on the roots of elephant garlic. These are actually called garlic corms with an M. I think on my last video I actually said corns, so I apologize for that. So they are called garlic corms and you can grow more elephant garlic from them. So they look like tiny baby cloves. As you can see, it's got a pointy tip just like a clove that cloves do and a blunt side. So when you plant these, you would plant it with a pointy tip um, up just like you would with garlic cloves. So it does take at least two years before they mature into these garlic bulbs that's already divided into the cloves. So the first year you plant these corms, you will get an elephant garlic like this. So it looks more like an onion and it has not divided into um, segments or cloves. So you can plant them again, save these to plant next this fall and next year on the second season you'll get a regular elephant garlic with the cloves already divided so again it'll take at least two to three years depending on how big they grow the first year but also sometimes they stay dormant they might not sprout until the second year you plant them so if these little baby cloves are left in the ground, which sometimes they do fall off, the elephant garlic, they will eventually germinate and they'll grow more garlic, elephant garlic plant for you. There's been a few elephant garlic plants growing out throughout our garden where I've never planted an elephant garlic clove. And that's what happened is these little cloves or corms get left behind and they self kind of self seed and self germinate. So these are the corms that fell off when I was harvesting the elephant garlic or that were left in the ground on top of the soil so I went ahead and picked them up so I can plant them again so remember first season you plant these you'll be harvesting these onion looking like bulbs you can still eat them and cook them like you would use leeks or elephant garlic because they do have a mild flavor similar to leeks so they're actually closer to leeks and they're a cousin of the garlic family when I plant this bulb this fall Next summer, I'll be harvesting a mature elephant garlic with the cloves already divided and maybe some more garlic corms. So there you have it. So if you have any of these corms growing from your elephant garlic, you can save them and plant them again. I hope that you guys found this video helpful and enjoyed it as well. And if you do, please give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for joining me, everyone. Have a wonderful day and happy gardening.